What? <laughs> Good evening, everybody. How is everybody <laughs> doing this Wednesday evening? Hello, hello. <laughs> nice, Brian. Very nice. Right. <laughs> All righty. So let's go through and say hi to everybody. Sounds like a plan. So got good evening, Hawaiian Pop. Good evening, Beaver Den, and welcome to your new addition to the Beaver Den family. Yes. Uh, hello, little Lydia. Hey, Chap. Hello, Craig. Hey, Bright Candy. Tickles. Tickles. Hey, Ness. Uh, hello, Tasha. Hey, Anne Marie. Hello, Haley. <laughs> Already grumbling back yes. there. Hey, Jeremy. Hey, Brian. And oh, ah, I jumped. jumped. Damn it, Janet. Yeah, hey, here. Linda. Uh, Tats. Tats. Nightshade. Neater. Welcome in. Hey, Big Dog Dave. DJ Patrick, how you doing tonight? Oops, Dwayne, Dwayne Lee. Mike Kelly, welcome in. And Shannon Furry B. <laughs> <laughs> hey, two boys and their pops. How are you tonight? Hey, Sleepy Dog. Hey, Daniel. Hey, Sean. Hey, I do, I do not exist. And I think, oh, we'll be popping. Yeah. And I think we're caught up. And Matthew. And Mrs. Phoenix Popcast. There we go. Hey, Sarah. Sarah. Haven't seen you in a while. Hey, hey Joshua. Joshua. Hey, hey, Ricky. Hey, MP. MPT. It's a different MPT. Right. Hi, oh. Ethel. And we have uh, an Ethel who's shoving me. Did we say hi room. to Alexandra? Alexandra. All right. Hi, Ali. We, we promise we didn't forget you on purpose. <laughs> it kept jumping. <laughs> <laughs> hey, AR Cross. Oh, Anne Marie. Yes, we did. Wait, there was a Tiny Ghost three pack today. What? I don't know what <laughs> you guys are talking about. Hi, Kate. Thank you, Daniel. So, so I guess you'll get us kicked off right into something that we'll talk about. And I believe I saw the Sindens in here. Yep. Hey, Sinden, how are you doing tonight? So tiny ghosts. Yes, tiny ghosts. Hey, lab jar. You passed on a man, Marie? Really? Hey, popping hand. So let me share these tiny ghosts. They're very, very, very cute. Hey, proud bird. So those are the new tiny ghosts. They dropped today in the Facebook group. Yes. Um, hey, Bob. I was going to say Funko Illuminati, but that was just longer than Bob. Yeah, it could be Sean, too. But yeah, yeah. Hey, Josh. <laughs> um, so we thought these were super cute. Hey, Logan D. Um, this is the first time they did the whale shark. Yes. So the other two have existing five-inch pops. And so now there's three inch of those two and a start. I'm assuming there'll be a five inch of the whale shark coming. And probably a mini as well. And yeah, a mini. And they don't have a mini of tiger the shark tiger yet. shark yet. So I'm sure it's coming. I bought every drop except the art print and Waldergeist. Yeah, we bought the art print. Yes. We opened that last week. Hey, IW or Ian. Um, hey, Scratch and Go Crazy. So, hey, LJ. Um, but, yeah, the Waldergeist, same with us, Amory. Not really our thing, but those ones are silly cute. Hey, Pop and Sun Pops. So, did anyone who was after those little ghosties get them? They're sick. I know. <laughs> very sick. We thought they were very cute. Yes. So Definitely need to pick them up. Had to have them. Thank you, Air Cross. Hey, Ivy Poppin. You know it, Brian got some. You too, Abby. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Uh, Ken's going nuts <laughs> with all the talk of ghosts. <laughs> well, we're not going to break you down. That's what you say now, Hawaiian Pop. Right. Mm. <laughs> oh. Someone, uh, Ricky got an FYE Tupac, Pennywise, and Dementor. Very nice. We need that FYE one. We'll the get Tupac? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Candyman. So. Yes, Alexandra, they're sick. 
Nice, LJ. <laughs> You'd rather get chomps? Well, we like chomps too. Yes. So there hasn't been any new ones since the ECCC one, but that one's delayed anyway. So, yeah. Congrats, Beaver Den. Boy or girl? Oh, you like watching the videos to curb your addiction? Uh, oh, good luck. We'll see how long that lasts. Right? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Girl. Girl. There we go. Very nice. Welcome, welcome. Your newest Tokidoki collector. Exactly. Oh. Oh. Hello? One moment. Oh, yeah. I will actually all come out right now. Yeah. All right. Uh, our bas we're the like the Baskin Robbins flavors of collectibles. You know, we like to share lots. Uh, we enjoy lots. We figure, why not share out what it is? And um, if other people like them, then that's cool too. So, hey, Aurelio. See, so, I mean, I know we've got some other items coming in. Uh, we're just waiting on them. They're pre-ordered. So once they get in, we'll definitely be. Uh, showing those as well. That is correct, Brian. Tomorrow night, Mega Chrono Battle. So uh, there will be six uh, six channels total, including us, doing Spring Break Chrono Boxes um, on our channel tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific Time, 9 Eastern. So be ready to be there. See what all we get. Hopefully, there's some amazingness pulled for somebody. Super right? Um, hey, quick draw. Hey, Brett Jones. Hey, what the deuce? So, yes, some food. Um, so, yeah. Yes. Three Nights of Lives. It's kind of been a, a uh, live week, if you want to say. Jack and wings, exactly. Yes, yeah, we got some uh, B dubs. Uh, figure it's a delicious and an easy way to get some some food. Um, hey, Lady Enigma. Hey, proud bird. Yes, and our bands for arms boxes showed up today. So we will be um, getting that scheduled. I think there will be, there end up being, I think, two lives that we do um, in order to get everybody in who wanted to do them. So we'll do five boxes on one and five boxes with another. Um, so, yeah. Oh, yes, Daniel. I... I saw that and I had to comment to him that it wouldn't matter which Mark Hamill pop it was, I would have been excited. Pop and Sons, you showed up yesterday. Nice. Is the cat in the kennel again? No, the cat is not in the kennel again. <laughs> <laughs> Did you open them up, LJ? And cheers, String Bean. It's all there. Excellent. And you got three boxes today as well. Nice. Hey, Grinchville. Um, so the so we've done three different of the more recent ones. The boxes we just got in were from the third wave of the COVID nineteen boxes. Yep. We got ten boxes from the Easter um, boxes, and then we got actually twelve boxes of yeah. the. Which ones were they? Childhood something. Yeah. So. We have 32 boxes come or here or coming. Yes. So. Oops. Right. Um, what's for dinner? Uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> and Grinchville. Welcome home. <laughs> <laughs> Did you order food with COVID on the side or on top? Totally on top. Yes. Daniel, did you get a box from us today? I hope so. I hope it came today. It should have come today. Um, are we getting anything from WonderCon? Yes. There are a couple of items that we're looking forward to. What's up? I put my phone somewhere. Ah, I was going to say, I pulled I it up. Pictures. 
Oh, you had pictures. Hold Lisa on. has pictures. No, I, no, hold on. I don't know where I put it. Hey, Ken. I do this every time. <laughs> huh, interesting. Uh, the, the, uh, already posted. Okay. How's it? Uh, let's see. I said hi to Ken. Sorry. Jumping around. Oh, sorry, Lou. <laughs> Cheshire cat. Yes, we want yes. Cheshire cat. Prickle pants. STC. Oh, nice. Hey, Donald. Um, second wave, but didn't get him in yet. Ah. Okay. I, I thought. Know. I think he thought he was through the second wave, but I don't know. Yeah. Males so, are super slow in your WonderCon area. to answer that. Target. Boba Fett, right? Yes. He wants that. I want the Cheshire cat. And then he wants the two, the Faker and the Skeletor sodas. Yes. Um, and then on Facebook, it says, I'm sure it's all over IG too, but um, the links are starting to be ready tomorrow at 9 p.m. Pacific time. So for all of us ordering online, that would be the place to go. There's links to everything available except for Amazon so far. So I have links for Barnes and Noble, for Rainbow Troll, Box Lunch for Miguel, FYE for Flocked Pikachu, Hot Topic, Flocked Eevee, Target, Futura, Boba Fett, Pop in a Box exclusive Marvel. That's different. That's not this one. That's the thing that they're announcing. Yeah. Um, and then the Funko Shop, obviously. So they're floating around. The links are already out there, ready to go. It's just they won't be. Um... Can I send you the links? Yeah, I can. We can. We'll. we'll uh, yeah. I can even just screenshot it and then Whoa. you guys could type it in too. Okay. Either way. That's all I have so far. So. Uh, the Cheshire Cats. Where? Ugh, I just left the page. Somebody's asking. Um. Previously, booth only exclusives. Now Funko Shop exclusives. There you go. So Ramona Flowers and Cheshire Cat are going to be at the Funko Shop. So. Uh, do we think Funko will do a cyber release on Friday? It's possible. I think yeah. with Funko and some of the other companies, we'll probably start seeing some reduced releases for a little bit. Mm -hmm. I think it, they're ca it's catching up on the time that the factories were shut down in China. Um, so I think that, and that's why I, we, I believe we've been seeing the cancellations on some of the pop right. pre-orders and stuff like that too. Yeah. Um, I could be wrong. But that's my guess is why we're seeing some of that happen yeah. um, and why we haven't been seeing as many of the Funko Shop drops that we were yeah, seeing for a like, while. There. They were pretty frequent for a while, and now they went down. Um, the other thing I was going to show, which most of you have probably already seen, is there's Box Lunch on Earth Day is doing Miko and Flit. So I don't know how well you guys can see that from my phone. There we go. Absolutely adorable. It's the box lunch exclusive one for Earth Day. Last year and the year before, I think they've done Wally and Eve. So now it's Pocahontas. So I want this one. I think this one's super cute. So and I don't think they've I don't think they've done a Miko pop, but I could be wrong. They might have already done a Miko. I don't know. Uh, uh, there we go. Wonder why they would cancel it instead of just postponing. For which one? And yes, I did see there was a Bill Nye, the science guy one. I didn't even do a screenshot because I didn't want it. <laughs> but that one is going to Hot Topic. So They did do a Miko. Oh, there is a okay. Miko. Okay. I don't have a Miko, but I want this Miko. <laughs> I've never actually seen the movie Pocahontas, so I think that's probably why I wasn't as interested. But gotcha. That pop's really cute. And yes, I said 9 o'clock tomorrow night, Pacific Standard Time, so California. Yes. Is so when, oh, when, is when everything okay. should start being dropped on those links. The place I follow, most anyone can go follow it. It's just on um, Facebook. I'm sure Dispops is going to post it all and everybody else right. on IG. This one just is some group called Funko Pop Hunters. I don't know. I don't know anything about them. I just have followed them for a while. And they're on Facebook. So... Uh, Larry, I believe so. And they should be, ha or Larry. I was going to yeah. say hashtag Larry. Be all fancy. 
So what's going on, Yo Jay? Uh oh. Letter of instruction. Oh, it doesn't have. Okay. Variety of goodies. Cool. We should have sent you more stuff. <laughs> Quit being like Sean. Still, <laughs> Pokemon is never, the movie never really interested me. I don't know. There is a red box around two little rivers from us, actually. Right. If you want to call them rivers. They're more like streams. And but, we have Disney Plus, so I'm, I'm pretty sure, sure we can find it. Yeah, it just wasn't <laughs> one that I was like super interested in watching. There's a couple of those like that. Like the that we commented the other day when we pulled that pop Meg. Oh yeah, Hercules. I've never seen that. And then the Kuzco guy. I am person who grew. Never seen that either. So I think I've seen most Disney movies probably once, but yeah. Oh, I didn't know that they were Funko Pop Hunters. I've heard of Nerd Therapy. I just didn't know that that was them. Interesting. Shut it, chap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not surprised, Aurelio. Especially right now when everyone's home, they need their children entertained, and right. there's nothing on there that is not kid-friendly, so please... Go watch is kind of, I think, what parents are doing a lot of the time. Well, and Disney's releasing quite a few things early early to yeah. Disney Plus right now because of everything going on. Like right. Onward came um, out, came out right already. Yeah. I believe that um, Rise of Skywalker is about to be on oh. there as well. So Interesting. I haven't seen that either. And it's amazing for adults, too. Yes. I would agree. Uh, okay. My order was delivered. Great. <laughs> so, hey, Disney lover. How are you doing? We were just talking Disney. Yep. Hey, Robert. <laughs> right, Robert? <laughs> Did you see you won some minis last night, Robert? I think Chief and Nerdy messaged you. Onward was good. I cried at the end a little bit. So. Definitely a good flip, though. It was good. Yeah. Very different than most Disney, though. Like... With the whole like dungeons y dragon y like nerd appeal yeah. and I don't know. Hey Lily. So what else is you saw it, fellas? I know you fell asleep, but you were still in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Bean only likes the X rated ones. Gotcha in the feels. I know. And yes, Lady Enigma, yeah, Lady Enigma, that is true. Definitely a personal favorite, yeah. I would agree. It was a good movie. Doesn't all of our work have us doing, well, us working in general, I feel yeah. like, yes. Hey, Andrew, how you doing tonight? Yeah, I feel like I'm more tired after work, doing the telework and working from home than I am on a normal day. Although I feel like it's just because normal day, I go in a certain time, I leave at a certain time. That's not necessarily right. the case working from home. Yeah. So, um, And Daniel, I bought already all the Onward Pops before I saw the movie. Actually, I have one I can open. I haven't opened oh, yeah, the Amazon huh? one yet. <laughs> um... Oh, Andrew, I saw a shirt today that you might like too. Let me... Uh pull it up here because I saw it and I was like I might have to get this shirt. So yeah, we bought all the ones when they came out, the day they came out. All the Onward Pops yeah. from Hot Topic. And yes, we actually got two Chase Unicorns um, but we gave one to Cheap and Nerdy. So because Brittany wanted one. So we have all of them. So yeah. I might have to get that shirt. There we go. Now it's focused. Although I think it should be the other way around. Sloth looking into a funhouse mirror and yeah. a Superman. <laughs> this box does not want to open. You have the pops on your PIAB wish list. Yeah. Uh, that is at RIPT. R-I-P-T. Oh, and it's in a sorter in a box. Amazon stepping up their game. Uh, a lot of the shirts you see that I get that are like this um, are all pop culture -y. A there lot of go. them are from Ripped Apparel. So speaking of Onward. There we go. 
Warrior Barley. There you go. So now we have all of them that are out. So I think they're very cute. I'm sure that the prices will go down on them because right now I think all the commons are close to 20 bucks, which is insane. Yeah. So. And Sean, I don't necessarily disagree with that. <laughs> Wilden Lightfoot. The dad? Yeah. Oh. The best pop. Ah. I, I, I hey, like King that Titus. one. Too. You need to get the Amazon one? Yeah. This is the Amazon one. So it's been sitting in this box for quite a while. Mm. Mm, March 3rd. Yeah, like we've commented before, we've got a whole stack of boxes oh, that we need to open. Oh, there's a giant fold on the side. Yeah. Eh, it is what it is. That's a factory fold, That's a factory though. issue. That's my Amazon Yeah, fold. that's a factory fold. So here he is. Spinny. 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 Hey, Kenneth. How are you doing tonight? So, I like these guys. I think they're cute. Um, I had a feeling I'd like this movie, so that's why I bought them all. So, yeah. Apparently, we're boring Alexandra. I, I, I mean, Alexandra needs to take a nap every now and again, and then she'll come back and be excited. Right? It's okay. <laughs> Thank you, Tiggles. Best spinny ever. Like, anyone could know that. Oh. <laughs> So, other than the box flaw, which looks like it's a Funko factory line all the way up and down, he's good. I will say, since Amazon has stepped up their game and is now shipping in a sorters. Right. <laughs> well, thank you, Michael Petrino. Say hello to Gaslecast if they are still live. Yes. They are great folks. They hunt together. Indeed. Copyright by them, not by me. So. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle hunts wolverines. Is that like a real thing? Hunting a wolverine? Yeah. Why wouldn't it be? I don't know. Are there like wolverines in the wild? Yes. They're, they're Do they basic... live in Key West? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just like wolves, not like wolverines. No, they're actually from the Badger family. Oh. Well, I guess I need some zoology lessons. We should do we should a live together. together. Ah, we'd be up for it. I don't know if they'd be up for it. I, I know they do interviews with people too. So yeah. I know we collect similar things. So Indeed. I know they do the tiny ghosts and all that stuff too. I see them in the Facebook group. So. Yeah. <laughs> Your brains are real animals and the keys are part of Florida. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. Thank you. I'm from the Badger family. I could be. I don't know. He's my own Wolverine. <laughs> I don't know. So. But yeah, I'm trying to think. There's. I feel like with everything going on, there's just not as much like. Volume to talk about. Yeah. Or and not that it's a bad thing. I just, know. I just mean just in general. In general. Well, WonderCon. Essentially yeah. canceled, but it is what it is, so we can all buy it all. Um, I mean, Earth Day Pops. Yeah. No new Funko announcements that I'm aware of. They're still currently planning on SDCC. No, <laughs> that ain't happening. <laughs> <laughs> I think we can all know that's not happening. We want to go to Designer Con, though. I think yes, that do. would be a lot of fun. Yes, so, we do. Um, yeah, I think... In looking at things, we're getting more and more interested in. Uh, we we're finding a lot more of the designer toys that we like, or the art toys. And let's uh, let's not talk about that. Um, but what? Oh goodness gracious! Um, and and I think designer con would be really cool to go to and check out. Uh, I actually just recently, as in like what two days ago, bought a. Microtech that's a one-off yep. by an artist that has done some stuff at designer con yep. um clav nine hasn't come in yet but it should come. be here tomorrow cool so we have to do a video because i have my what my lottery win too i know well i was hoping we can't win funko shit but we can win tech lotteries right yeah 
that's basically oh so here's the other shit show news for all of you excuse my language <laughs> So I have to apologize in advance for anyone we said we would try to help with fig pins. And here is why. So we both won lottery for fig pin for ECCC. And yesterday at 10 a.m. was the time when we were supposed to be able to get our redemption code, go in, buy one of each. Right? Sounds great. Sounds easy. So we both log on. He goes in and he gets his 11 fig pins in his cart. He checks out. No problem. I'm sitting next to him on my phone, adding the fig pins, adding the fig pins. I get five in my cart. I go to add the sixth and it goes back to enter your redemption code. And I'm like, that shouldn't happen. So I click into it. I copy and paste and it turns red and shakes like, no, you can't buy this fig pin. And I'm like, okay. So we went back and forth, tried it a number of times. Finally, it was like, okay, this isn't working. Can't buy the fig pins. So we messaged to Read Pop, who messages back and forth a number of times yesterday, asked for screenshots, asked for videos. I sent it all. I sent screenshots. I sent a video of what was going on, trying to figure out how can I order these fig pins. They kept saying they weren't getting my attachments, even though I could see them in the emails. So then end of day, finally, I'm like, I'm not getting a response. I get a response this morning and it says, oh, it looks like Figpin's site is working just fine. Go on in and do what you want to do and buy stuff. Then I get a second email that says, uh, follow up with support at figpin.com. It's like, okay. So I click into the website. There's no fig pins on the website. The Figpin website says coming soon. Like, no offer of purchase, no, no clicking, no nothing. And I'm like, okay. So I sent the same email to support at Figpin 10 this morning. No response. Nothing. They didn't even write back. So I got to buy no fig pins from my one lottery win from ECCC. So anyone we said we would try to help, we now don't have any extras. So lucky yeah. us. At least of the ones that most people ask for help for. Yeah, which I feel bad. So I feel bad for who I was trying to help. I mean, yeah. in all reality, it, we, we're going to get what we want because we got the one set from James. It was just whoever else we said, yeah, good job, Lisa. It was my fault. <laughs> so, But just the fact that Figpin didn't even respond today. I was like, oh, come on. Like, what yeah. else are you all doing other than being on your computers, answering emails? And it's not like I'm complaining and wanting a refund or any anything for free. I'm willing to give you money, but you can't respond. So I don't know. I don't know if anyone else who had lottery had the same problem. I did get a message back saying that it was a known issue and I wasn't basically the only one who had the issue, yet they did nothing to fix it. So, yeah. And Figpin is getting expensive. Yeah, I think you spent what, 280, 270? With shipping, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, I don't feel bad for me because we got them. I just feel bad for everyone that we said we would try to help. Yeah. That, so, that was the big, that's the big thing is that. Like, I know Smitty, we were trying to help. I know Larry. I mean, there was Grump. Grump. There was a couple people that I know we said we would definitely try, buy an extra one. I couldn't get a single fig pin. So if when you copied code, it copied blank. No, it wasn't doing that either. So it was like, it was the exact copy and paste. Cause we even tried it on different, like different times and nothing. Yeah. It wouldn't accept the code and it would, it kept kicking me back out. So my cart still shows I have five things in it. But I can't, like, get the five at this point. And most of the five that were in there weren't things people actually wanted. I hadn't even got that far yet. <laughs> so it's like, I think the things sitting in my cart were, like, Godzilla and Bruce Lee and the Sanrio Hello Kitty. And there were two others. I don't remember even what they were. But they weren't even the ones people had asked for. Otherwise, I could have checked out with just the five. Somebody asked for Bruce Lee. Who asked for Bruce Lee? I thought Grump asked for Bruce. I don't know. Either don't way, know. there was only five, and I was trying to get all of them, but yeah. So currently no fig pins for me, nor anyone else that I thought I could help. 
So I'm sorry. Hopefully that changes though. I we'll doubt see. it. They never even wrote back. Maybe because Rude it was a known people. issue. They were busy it, and you were farther back in line. Maybe, but it said by 5 p.m. today, everything was shut for closed, done for lottery winners. Right. But if there was an issue that they couldn't fix, yeah. they should. Emphasis on should. You got grump. Um, okay. Thanks, Sean. Yeah. I I tried. I did. I promise. Right. Hey, JJ. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know if I did something wrong. I don't know if I clicked something funky, but all I know is it stopped working. So, yeah. sorry. You have two <laughs> fig pins because they were cheap. Cool. He has a bunch of fig pins. I do. I don't. I don't collect them as much as he does. So, I only have like a very <laughs> few Disney ones, and then I have the one Harry Potter that they have. Yeah. And that's it. So, hey, Court of Pops, how are you doing? I mean, for the most part, most of them, my fig pins are my hero they academia. Are. Uh, there are a few others. There's uh, I've got some Spider Man, yeah, um, and a couple other and some other Marvels and that. But yeah, the Stitch one is cute, Alexander. It's a very different Stitch, in my opinion, than normal. So another black <laughs> hole, right? Yeah, hey, we hear you. We hear you. Same with Robert. He's like, I aim to keep it that way. So in other words, send fig pins to Robert. Breaks YouTube. Well, well, it's one of those that he's like, oh, if you send it to me, I'll right. take it. I'm just not going to go buy it. Okay. Well, he's getting a Tokidoki. So, I mean, maybe that'll be. That is true. You know, his next, him or Carolyn's next downfall. That is I true. I don't know. So. What else is going on in the world of weird vinyl things? So. Well, that's nice, Candyman. They didn't do that for Figpin. <laughs> Uh-oh, JJ. It got lost in the wash. Uh-oh. Or the claw, like little aliens ran off. I don't know. What do we think of the oh. Funko pins? I am... I, I haven't I actually seen... I see them in person. Yeah, I haven't seen one in person. Um, no. What I was hoping to do from ECCC was get the Thanos pin, compare it to the Thanos fig pin, yeah. and be like, here's the difference. The difference and which one I prefer. From everything I've seen, I think the fig pins are head and shoulders okay. nicer, better looking, everything um, above the the Funko pins. But I, I wanna see one. Yeah. Like I haven't seen one yet, like a real in life in front of me one. I've just seen pictures and sometimes pictures are misleading. Kind of like Butt Stallion. Right. Right? Saw the picture of Butt Stallion from NYCC and was like, eh, whatever about that pop. Saw it in person. I was like, okay, that's a cool pop. So we want to see them in person, but yeah. yeah, I don't know. I mean. I, I feel like the Funko pins. They're too big. Look, well, they're too big, and I feel like it. it's like a five-year-old tried to draw <laughs> the Funko pop for the pin. Yeah, that's fair is, is what the, gl the glam shots look like right. to me. Yeah. I, I, Hey, Wolf King. You're totally wrong, um, but that's just what I've yeah. seen so far. Um, pops, I'd rather go down the tiny ghost black hole <laughs> over the fig pin black hole. The problem is tiny ghosts can be a whole lot more difficult to get. They can, which is good sometimes, but bad on other right. times. Like if you're a completionist, it's not easy. We're not, we can't be completionist with tiny ghosts only because of how expensive some of this stuff is. So <laughs> nice. Girl. See, but I didn't think the Hedwig Pid was that bad. That like one's the not XL as bad. Hedwig pin. Oh no, wait. I'm thinking of the the fig pin. Oh, fig yeah. pin is good. Sorry, wrong one. <laughs> so great breakdown. Yeah, Grump. It's quite possible that that artist who drew me that lovely Harry Potter <laughs> Freddy Funko, which was a bunch of red, yellow, and green circles, could have definitely been the one to design them. So, uh, will we buy from Chrono? I will say we will likely not ever buy any more of the weekly challenger boxes. Probably not. But Some other of the things. bigger boxes we might still do. Yeah. Um, the bigger boxes are decent. Yeah. The issue has been with the weekly challengers yeah. that where we essentially always get dupes. So, exactly what um, yeah. So we still will. We actually, I mean, we have tomorrow. Five chrono boxes for tomorrow. Yeah, Surprise. so we'll, we'll be doing the the miss. We got a uh, five of the spring break boxes yeah. that we'll be doing the battle on our channel tomorrow night. 
uh, at 6 p.m. Pacific time, 9 Eastern, yep. with several people who are in chat. Yep. So we got Sean, we got Cheap and Nerdy, we got Coke Fresh, we got Luau, and we got Yoje. Yes. So the six of us will be doing, I think, four or five boxes each Yeah. Um, tomorrow evening. We haven't decided rules yet or for winners or any of that good jazz, but we'll pay, we'll figure it out. So, yeah, those those freaking ten dollar or whatever eleven ninety nine or ten ninety nine boxes for Monday on Chrono just don't like us. No. So, pulled a Gandalf thirteen from the Hobbit with a Yobi exclusive sticker out of one tonight out of a Chrono box. Very nice. I think that's one that Cheap and Nerdy might be after too. It's possible. Because they lost the Hobbit Pops. Yes. They don't have them. Dang. Uh, fake Dragon Ball Pop in the mystery box. Interesting. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Yes, we're weenies, Sean. It's okay. I, I don't know why we're weenies. Because we don't want to buy those ten ninety nine boxes. Oh, because we get duplicates every time? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I'd rather... Hey, hey Pop Chatty. Tokyo. I'd rather spend the same amount of money and get the Band for Arms boxes. Even if we get a common. Yes. So. <laughs> Alexandra, I don't know. I don't know what they win. <laughs> <laughs> Alexandra's undying love. <laughs> right. They they win falling for sending Alexandra money. Yep. <laughs> so. I know exactly. Grump, what do we win? <laughs> but, uh, yeah. I, I will say, I think our first set of bands for arms boxes were decent. I, yeah, I mean, you're paying common price, and if you get a common pop, you can't be that upset, number one. And yeah. number two, most all the money from all these mystery boxes are going to some kind of charitable cause. Yes. So, essentially, you're donating minus your shipping to right. something. So, I mean, with... The COVID one, it's going, I think, to some kind of research thing. The Easter one is going to supplies for troops. And then I don't know what the third one is going to. But, I mean, they're going somewhere. Yeah. So, yeah, they said that before, though, too, Sean. Um, and they usually yeah. come back. So, yes. And it's great because it's free. They do free shipping. Yeah. So, not all the time, but... Some of the, the first run, I think we paid shipping. Right. And then the last three orders we've made was free shipping, which is insanely amazing. So, because if you saw the size of the box, most of us have come that came in today. It right. wasn't cheap, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. So, when you're shipping 10 pops to someone. Yeah. And so. they're, each pop is individually boxed. Yes. Plus some, some protection in the box for those boxes. Yeah. Um, yeah. You can't be cheap. So you got two. What? Alexander got boxes? Holy guacamole. Hey, God, your pops. The world is coming to an end. Alexandra has bought a mystery box. What? Here's the question though. Is she gonna make a video? No, it's Alexandra. She, it's it's gonna be. <laughs> I'm opening the box. Don't look. Don't watch me open the box. <laughs> There's not going to be any voice either. It's going to be little That's subtitles true. that right. run through. Fair enough. So, <laughs> Alexandra. <laughs> and Chabby made a custom pop named John Doe, a.k.a. anti-COVID-19. <laughs> nice. So, did you guys hear? I know, totally off topic, but the COVID thing. There was twins born in India that their parents named them Corona and covid like, really? I don't know if you guys heard about that. I saw it on Facebook. So. But, I mean, I, I see Wolf King saying he hasn't got any mystery boxes yet. Um, one day. One day. I, again, some of the what you got to look at is, is there something in there that you want? Right. And do you feel like it's in your favor enough to do it? And so. you have money disposable some disposable extra money yes so. poor kids they will kill their parents someday <laughs> and yes people outside the u.s are also dumb <laughs> but yes some i mean publicity wise of course i'm sure it had something to do with that 
So Keanu Reeves for their first first name. name. Oh my gosh. (laughs) Um, We did not get the, I think it was a $350 Pop King Paul box. We did not. Oh, it's Cope. What up? Yeah. We've been sticking to the smaller boxes more recently. Not the pricey, pricey ones. We usually buy the pricey ones around Black Friday. Yes. It's just a yearly thing for the really expensive ones. And then when it comes to throughout the year, it's just kind of um, cheaper. And Luau, we have a box from you on the table. Andrew, it's on the table. I haven't opened it it yet. (laughs) Was it yesterday? Yes. Yeah, I picked it up yesterday at the post office. (laughs) <laughs> Alexandra. <laughs> Shots fired. Hey, hey Jenna Howard. Howard. So. Yeah. I don't know. Open it. I, I was gonna, that was quick. I, I was going to do it in a video. I think. Because yeah. I've got, we've got a couple boxes from friends. Yeah. So I wanted to do boxes from friends together. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> we I, sent... have, I have other boxes. I, 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 I have a different box I could open. <laughs> I think over the course of the past three days, we've mailed like <laughs> 17 boxes or something. It's just crazy. You keep getting anime. Well, we always get DBZ, so... Quite often. I mean, we don't collect that either. Thank you, Cope. Much appreciated. Did I tell you he's sending us a soda? Yes. Great, great, babe. (coughs) And if we get the chase, he has plenty of comments. Yes. You did read the (laughs) message. Open something. Anything. Okay. I can. I know something I can open. But yeah, we haven't mailed your chat, Sean. (laughs) But it's packed. But it needs to be repacked. It needs to go in a slightly bigger box because the box that it's in, once we finish padding things appropriately, it won't. Not good. So we have to repack it. Doing, Doing a, a custom, custom Funko, Funko Pop, Pop tech. tech. Nice. Mm, interesting, Chabby. You won Target's 10 inch Pusheen from Funko. Nice, Aurelio. That is one, even though I collect all the Pusheens, I did not want that one. 10 inch is just sometimes too, too much. So, yeah, I don't know. Couldn't bring myself to get that. <laughs> Oh, yes. Thank you for catching up, Brian, on what he missed. We'll be popping. Much appreciated. I think James is finding something to open. I have no idea what. Yeah, but we got to find other stuff too, Sean, for your birthday. Because we still haven't figured out what we're getting you. We've had some suggestions from people. But I don't know. I ordered the 18-inch Harry Potter, Alexandra. Yes, yes, I did. So B Cobb had shared a website with a bunch of people that had a good deal, and I, we ordered it. I don't know when I'll get it, but I ordered it. So yes, there will be an 18-inch Harry Potter sometime in our house. What are you opening? So I could do a couple different things. <laughs> okay, we got boxes. Alexander, it's always your birthday. Right. Don't I always cope? If it was 18 inches, that would be like down to his knees. That's okay. not okay. My knife is over there. Uh, Aurelio, not recently, no. But I also haven't been looking. So. Stop. Just sit down. Your dog is too much. I know. So. Oh, I should have got Deadpool bat boxes. Oh, whatever. You got two in front of you already. Well, people have <laughs> probably seen all these too. I'm sure they have. Yeah. I haven't seen it all. I haven't either. Because we haven't even opened it. No. It's still sealed. <laughs> Be right back. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. <laughs> 10 inch Nightmare Before Christmas, including designer series and Mayor with Chase. Wow. No worries, Larry. Chase Box is supposed to be a set of weight on the rail or something big. Odds are good, yeah. There's always smiling. 
Yeah, no kidding, Anne Marie. I was on a Teams meeting earlier, and Hagrid just howled for 45 minutes at me because he wanted a quesadilla, and we couldn't get him to stop. So, hello there, Matthew Moser. How are you doing? Sneaking at work to watch. <laughs> Matthew's not watching YouTube. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got four boxes in front of me I can open. Yep. I've got two more crates. And I've got two collector core boxes. Yes. Hey, Eric's Pop Lounge, how are you doing? So I start with a Deadpool. You'll Deadpool? go rotate. Deadpool. Right. Hey, stop it. The new NBC pops. Oh, we don't collect NBC. No. All right. So, first Deadpool box. We are, LJ. I got a tie. <laughs> it's an X-Men tie. Is it an X-Men tie? Well, Deadpool, X-Men. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Flurkins are on the table all the time. We were just mad at her for clawing the chairs. Yes. So, it's time for wearing a tie with your truffle shuffle shirt. Yep. Right? Exactly. Aurelio. I know. I'm sorry. We don't do NBC. I've never even seen the whole movie. Hey, do you make you famous? Is the tie silk, you were asked? I don't know if it's silk. It's satiny. Nightmare Before Christmas, Dave. NBC. There we go. He's fancy now. <laughs> He's here to party. <laughs> right. X oh, it's probably X Force. X good, good call. Yes, yeah, probably X Force. There we go. Ooh, a full Windsor, my man. <laughs> uh, military, you know this. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't do a tie, tie, tie to save my life. <laughs> Thank you. Do you make you famous? Uh, so next up, we've got game show name tag stickers, Deadpool and Cable, Deadpool's sidekick. Interesting. When do you ever wear? He wears a tie daily, Matthew. I well, when he's when not I'm going in, to work. When I'm in the office, I wear a tie every day. Every day. Yep. So he is in a tie all the time. Here is the pin, and it is big. Um, but it is take it, take out. it out. The glare is crazy. Military only one option. I love hearing. Is that a flipping clip on? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> when he goes on stage for his night job, but just wearing a tie. That's right. <laughs> tie and a speedo. <laughs> So, but that's a cool pin. It's big. It's kind of heavy. Yeah. Looks like the front of a truck. Yeah, it's oh, a it's a TV. TV with cable. Yeah. The only and time I've worn a tie was on my wedding day. Hey, TPC collectors. How are you doing? Yeah, two shirts as well. <laughs> Tickle says, working from home, you just wear a tie. <laughs> right. And so this is a long sleeve tee. Oh, there we go. And it's not on his neck either. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> And one There's more another shirt. shirt. When did they ever send two shirts? I guess they decided to this month. Two shirts or and a when tie. They this month. And the Lady Deadpool show. I'm totally binge worthy. She has pizza, a teddy bear, and a sword, and some blood somewhere. Lovely. <sighs> box so there, one. That is box one. Merc crate box. Japan. I did stop getting these. I like the boxes, but I stopped getting them because it took them forever to get the boxes to me. So, What's your riddle, Eric? Throw it in the chat. We need to clean our table. Yeah, I know. I'm just looking at the reflection. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kenneth. All right, we will move on to a... Merc or non Merc, uh, Amazon box. So, Fantastic Collector Core, Four, Fantastic Four. So, as I think this has been out for a while. Many of you know this is an older one. When did this get shipped to us? 
January 31st. <laughs> you know, we got boxes. Oh, very few who actually said your last name correctly. Well, you're welcome, <laughs> Mr. Moser. Mr. Moser, report back to work. The box glows in what? the dark. Oh, well, that's I'll cool. Just check it out. I, yeah, one of those. I'm. I guess I'm behind. So we're a little behind. Coming soon, Infinity Saga, yeah, March, which, which is down there. <laughs> is down by my feet right now. <laughs> yes. I think I need to clean the table. <laughs> so, a very cool Doctor Doom pen. Again, most of you guys have probably seen this. Yeah. Spoiler alert. Yeah. From January. I, we are I'm swimming in boxes. Sure there are that is a fair story. Plenty of videos that show all of this. Yeah. I'm pretty so. sure some other people are worse than us, though. Sean. Sean. Calling Sean. What? About swimming in boxes? Yes. Uh, <laughs> you, I saw glams of the March box. The shirt, which is cool. I'll definitely wear it. The world's greatest comic heroes. I like thing. The other ones are kind of mimi. Bono, you're worse. Who's Bono? I, I mean, besides the lead singer of U2. <laughs> no, <laughs> you're worse. You have a damn trailer. Yes, we have a trailer <laughs> full of stuff, too. Yep. Or, Brian, it's killing me to go a week without opening boxes. You guys are ridiculous. We just don't have time. Yeah. Sticker? Sticker. Sticker. From Fiery Guy. That's Human Torch. There you go. Human Torch, Fiery Guy. <laughs> I think I bought his pop already, too. I have now, I now have the glow pop. Well, I've had the glow pop sitting oh. in a box here. Mr. Fantastic Pop. That one's meh. Not very exciting. No. And no. Human Torch Glow in the Dark. Oh, I want to see his glow. There we go. That one's okay. Not very exciting. Not going to lie. No? No. I mean, I, I definitely like the Human Torch. The shirt is cool. Definitely wear the shirt. The pin is very cool. I like and Dr. Doom. Box fort greater than pillow fort. Probably true. That's what Cope said. Yeah. So. The, the glow, glow is, is awesome. awesome. Well, that's good. I have no answer for that. Do you make you famous? What? What happened to two peas in a pot? Oh. Yeah, we don't know. I don't know. Uh, to be honest, the last time we messaged them, they never, they never messaged responded. Back, so I was going to Indiana and I asked about recommendations for Funko Shop, Funko Pop hunting. No response. So I don't know. Bye, Eric. See you later, Eric. Sent you the glow. Oh, let me look, Bob. Oh, that is cool. Oh, okay, that is good. Cool. Ooh, that's really glary. So you guys can see the stickers on our. There's Larry's sticker and yeah. Luau. Yeah. And, and but anyway, there's yeah. the glowing box. And do you make you famous? No worries. We yeah, we just don't know. And, and like we said last time, we had messaged them. They just they never messaged. They never back. messaged. So they're. I'm sure that they're busy um, with. Uh, life, life, yeah. Children. Lots of kids and everything, and then, um, so. yeah. Stephen still does Sith talkers, the po the podcast he was doing. So, and next time I'm in Indiana, well, I'm sure there'll be a next time. So I will do that, Hallie. So, so all right. I'm on to my next Merc crate. Merc. A blanket? I think it's a pillow. Oh, it's a pillow. It's a pillow. Not too excited about Black Widow, but you hope you're wrong. Yeah. I'm happy that they stopped doing pop rides, pop whatever they are, the big ones for all these stupid boxes. Because the big pops are just, they never, they're just ugly, most of them. <laughs> so, 
So on one side, you got Deadpool saying curious. curious. On the other side, thought so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey let's pop some more. <laughs> thank, thank you very you. much. Uh, oh, very nice, Bob. He used the black light LED he bought with the Amazon gift card he won oh, from us. Nice. So, is that a pillowcase? <laughs> uh, no. No? It is boxers. Oh, just kidding. All right. So, Want to see James's underwear? <laughs> Not the ones I'm wearing. Right <laughs> <now>. <laughs> I'm a hater. How many pops do we have? Uh, I don't know. We're working on PPG and everything. My guess is close to, if not over 2K. So. <laughs> don't forget the chimichanga. Meet me in the red room. So, this, I mean, they feel comfy. I'm sure I'll probably wear them at some point. <laughs> you know, new underwear. Because you need it. <laughs> You're dying. Because <laughs> we're showing off undies, you know. <laughs> it's just a green scheme. Yeah, no, we, we don't have any pops in this house. <laughs> right. None. So. Chap. <laughs> You don't want to shimmy out. Fair enough. You chap wants them used. <laughs> used. Perfect. So it looks like also a toiletry bag. Oh. Deadpool toiletry bag. But James, will you wear those? He will. Yeah. A reversible? No, just on the front and the back. <laughs> this must have been the Valentine's Day because there's two heart shaped pins. And 2K total or just the keepers? I don't know the answer to that, Sean. Oh, oh. I'm guessing 2K total. Oh, it's got to be one 2K total. You think it's more? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. We lost track. <laughs> Sorry, Jayla. <laughs> so I think I have a feeling that these are probably like Valentine's Day cards. <laughs> Brian. You're, you're cute in an angry, terrifying way. James is going to wear the tie boxers and put a sandwich in that Deadpool bag. <laughs> and he could wear the mask. He has a mask, too. He could wear that as well. Very true. So, Brian, they're well over 2K. Lisa's lying to herself. I've been trying to sell pops, not get more, even though we have 32 boxes coming. Should I open this? If you want it, it's yours. I don't. Aurelio, no. And I didn't want it. We got offered it from a couple people we knew that went to decon last year and I said, no, thank you. So you probably have Sean, you order way more than we do. Oh yeah. We don't have 5,000 in total. Oh, in total collectibles. Yeah. I don't know about that high. So I don't know. I don't think that many. No. I mean, if you count like every individual tiny little mini or something too, maybe. But that would take a lot of counting. And like if we had like 10 people to come in and do it for us. <laughs> sure. What's our top three? So define top three. Like top three we like. Top three valuable. Top. What do you mean by top three? The minis do add up. They do. So, oh, they're all different. They're all different. So that was one of them. Next one. I can't get you off my mind. Please leave. It hurts. So top three value. Well, Metallic Martian is the first. I know that. He's like nine some 900 now. Glow in the Dark Skeletor is number two, which is 500. And Tupac is number three so far. So... And then top three we like. So his are between Motu and Thundercats, right? Yeah, probably, mostly, yeah. And mine are mainly Harry Potter and then the Willy Wonka and Oompa Loompa Freddy Funkos. So. Uh, so this next one, I give our relationship a thumbs up, metaphorically, unless you're into that. What do you mean, Ken? What are the top three on the wall display near the steering? There's more than three. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a lot you guys don't see of them. 
but I'm not sure which ones you mean. Yes, Sean, you do. He's being a dink. Just being an eggplant. All right, good. Metallic genie, steep drop and trice, chase, huckleberry from ECCC. Gotcha. Yeah, we're considering getting rid of most of our ad icons. Yep. It's been a decision lately. I don't know. We're, we're talking about it. We're going back and forth because it's like, okay, we can get rid of this one, but we want to kind of keep that one. And so it's like, well, if you're getting rid of one, you kind of want to get rid of them all. And then I don't know. So, yeah. so very nice, Larry. You want diamond salt? That one looks cute. Oh, God, dog. So we could probably do an ad icon mystery box, but we don't have a ton of super high value ones. We've got like Lucky Glow in the Dark, which I think is in the 70s now. Used to be more. We have Sunny the Toucan. Sunny the Cuckoo. Cuckoo, whatever he is. Sorry, Sunny the Cuckoo. He's like 90-ish. I don't know. I don't think there's anyone else that's super valuable that we own. We don't own a lot of ad icons. It was just never something we went after a lot. So. <laughs> People are like, oh. I would buy them for sure. <laughs> I need them all. So, uh, X Marvel box. Infinity Saga. Waffle fries for ad icons. We'll think about it. I'm not sure. Again, like I said, we're like, eh, maybe we want to get rid of it. Maybe we don't. Yeah. It's kind of a back and forth. So, I am going to get rid of most of my Mickey Mouse pops. So... Yeah. All Hi, the Bob. like more comedy ones. Thanks for coming so. and hanging out. All right. So this, so this is, is a new box, I think right? The newer box. These are the pops that look cool in this one that I saw in the picture. I think so, yeah. I hope. So the pin. Is that Captain, Captain Marvel? Marvel? Yep. Cute. What is it, Daniel? The Piab one for tomorrow? Pop in a box. Yeah, but what's the pop? I don't know. Oh, um, so Disney lover. Yeah, I know my washer's just finished. <laughs> I think I'm going to get rid of a lot of the common Mickey's and I think I'm just going to keep going with series one to five, which is all I really want right now. So, um, I'm definitely keeping sorcerer Mickey, which I already own Peter Tingle. That's a cute shirt. Um, but yeah, when it comes to like all those Funko shop ones, all the different color variants, all the, I don't know. I just kind of lost interest and we don't have room and they're all sitting in boxes and yeah. Oh, cool decal sticker. So what are you umming? Uh, I was going to say Peter because of that, <laughs> <laughs> Brian. Oh, they haven't announced it yet. I like the Peter tip one. It's cute. You need purple and pink Mickey. You never got them. We most likely will be selling them. So That's cool. Glow in the dark Star Lord with the Power Stone. I like that. Is it? It's glow. In, what's? Oh, yeah. I'm assuming all the purple is a glow. I think so. Yeah. That's cool. All the items are glow, is what Aurelio just said. Well, yeah. The uh, Black Panther is also glow. Yeah. If I can get them. Doesn't want to come out. And yeah. Boy, damn there. I like that one. That reminds me of that Target exclusive one we never got. Yeah. <laughs> You're very welcome, Jayla. I will put a little sorry, not sorry out there because right. <laughs> it gets crazy quick. So, yeah, Disney Lover. Yeah, we got the um, Sorcerer Mickey in a mystery box yeah. from what's his name in the. In, oh, uh, that was from um, Nerds Like Us. Yeah, Nerds Like Us. So, that one <clears throat> we do want to keep. Yeah. So, oh, someone guessed it. So, what is it, Daniel? Thank you. Mm -hmm. 
you can't blame us. Good. Don't blame us for that one. <laughs> you only want Steamboat Willie. Mickey? Gotcha. Daniel, isn't it Carla Unger? Who's Carla Unger? Oh, yeah, yeah. They did announce. I think they did announce that, yeah. Who's that? I don't remember. I One of those. I'm not full on with all the uh, Venom stuff and all those. And Smitty, I we're potentially getting rid of the Alamo City Batman. Carnage's daughter. Oh, yeah. So James is deciding if he wants to keep the Alamo City Batman, but off the top of my head, that's the only Batman we have right now. Yeah. So you got a Kool-Aid man and a Busby. Busby, I know James wants to keep. Yes. Kool-Aid man, I don't know the answer. Haven't got that far. He hasn't. I don't think we've even seen him in a box yet. Who? Kool-Aid man. I don't remember seeing him over there. Oh, yeah. Oh, you did? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I know we own him, if not two. So, oh, I'm Batman. They're not hockey bats. What's that? It's a whole thing. Oh. That's the whole thing. Is the Doctor Who Carnage attached to? Hmm. I don't know. Chick pop. Hopefully it looks good. Right. And not just like a chick in a white coat because she's a doctor. Oh, it'll, I'm sure it'll look it'll like Venomized style. Okay. Like it's, yeah. Well, that'll be good. I just don't know who she is. Hey, Captain America. Congrats on last week's win, by the way. Indeed. I hope you've received it. Yes. It should have most, it most likely should have shown up today. Yeah. So. I. I know what Carnage is, Sean. The Bane one broke you. Yeah, that one, yeah. <laughs> the Bane? What? The, I, I'm assuming she's talking about that skit. That oh, video she didn't get it with yet? Bane. That's too bad. And it was two day shipping. Should have got there already. Those bums. So, you got 150 in during the stream? Wow. No film. Or did you already pre-undo the film? Because that's the slow part. Right. So, James should keep him for the Alamo City Batman. He's a cool pop. He is a cool pop. I, I don't disagree. And the reason that I would oh. probably keep him is because he's metallic and it's the, the Adam West style Batman. You clearly are, Sean. Yeah, I wish we did that, Larry. Yeah. We don't do that. We've got boxes. <laughs> We're in California, Jayla. Northern California. So, Okay. We're, We're over an hour. Our dinner's getting cold. We need to do some type of givey away thingy. Okay. I don't know what we're giving away, though. Help. We need suggestions. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> if we're across the world. <laughs> oh. A dollar? We should give away a dollar? We've done that before. We gave away a dollar and a Fortnite pop. Care of Brian and Brittany. Yes. Give away the boxers. I'm probably going to wear the boxers. So, Tiny Ghost, we do have some minis. We have a couple minis. Yep. Some sort of pop. Some and then we got pop. plenty of pops. Oh, she's in New York. We went to NYCC. Flock Lano is not no. going anywhere. <laughs> Give away the wings. Ooh, I don't know how long those would last. Right. Ken Griffey. No giving away Ken Griffey. Uh, yes. Damn you, pop couple, and your dollar. I know, <laughs> I know, I know. So... The boxers to chap after you wear them. <laughs> no tiny crap. <laughs> hey, variety show. <laughs> You're dodging tornadoes. Oh, goodness gracious. Give your cold dinner. No. A pen. Whoever gets it will get a pen. This is true. A tech. No. A mystery pop. Could do a mystery. Yeah. Tiny go. It could be something. Which reminds me, we still need to put Chap's box together. I know. And his, well, 
I gotta wait until I get oh, that we'll put everything from. Together I'll them. mail it yeah. once. So chap, it might take a little while for yours because I'm gonna get the stuff from Brittany. I think first. I don't know. We still have to figure out last night's stuff. Alexandra, if you win, I will send you a dollar and a potato. Just letting you know right now, dollar <laughs> and a potato. You have that on film. So. Larry got a pen, and apparently it's awesome. There we go. And Sean commented or complimented our pen as well today. Indeed. So. Indeed. Can confirm about the pen. Hallie seems to like the pen. Yeah. We send. Oh, so am I sending you chap stuff? I we'll figure it out. We'll figure it. Either way. Yes. Because I have stuff to send a chap to. So okay. So, but we also need a video. Right. <laughs> Are we, I mean, we could also do a mini chomp. Yeah, we got, do it's okay. Else. We'll do a mystery. We'll do a mystery. Okay, it'll we'll be a, a mystery. mystery. A mystery. Um. <laughs> Sorry, Ness. No worries. Court of Pops just messaged back. Uh, uh, chap, <laughs> do you want to be part of the Pen15 Club? Give me your hand. Let me write it down. That's how you were initiated. No? No. Uh, exactly. I remember doing that when I was in grade school. Yeah. So. <laughs> Auntie Addie, the, your dollar's worth more than my dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Please hold. James is looking up something. If I could Go spell. Ahead. I was like, I don't know what he's saying. <laughs> what is that? I think this is it. This is bigger. Who is this? So he's he's come into chats and stuff like that. To he's ours smart. or to whose? I know he's been in booze and pops. Oh. We could all I mean we could also potentially just do uh mm. I was gonna say we could also potentially just do the one too. Uh-huh. What do you you can look it up. Please hold all. We're finding a video. All right, I'll be right. Yep. Easy, yeah. Still quick and nice, camera. Sure thing. All right. So, please hold. Continue. We're working. Yes, please continue to hold. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, we haven't really been paying attention to chat. <laughs> Just saying. Um, <laughs> link. Uh, Sean, I don't think you're the only one who wants that. I can get you a midget of Kyle. Uh, uh, uh. Did we freeze? No. no. Okay. Where's the hold music? Um... <laughs> Uh, yeah, you don't need the quotes though, but yes. But that's telling them what to type. Oh, okay, that that's works. Tell them what to comment. That works. That's what I said. Okay. All right. Bading. So that is where you are going to go leave a comment and say hi, hi from Hop Couple. Yes. Um, and then if people wouldn't mind hitting our like button, that would be nice too. We already have a dislike. I know we're awful. So, I mean, if you need to hit that too, it's okay. So, uh, make sure when you go over to the video that you are at least watching one to two minutes in order to not be directed into spam. Don't leave it as a hashtag in case it filters you out. So, just leave it as a normal comment. Hi from Pop Couple. And should you be inclined to hit the red subscribe button, I'm sure these individuals, once they figure out who they are, will be thankful for that. Yes. And it'll be for a mystery item. I don't know what the mystery item is, so it's a mystery item. It'll be something. 
Hi. And now you've flirking. got a flurkin. It's a flurkin. You're welcome, Jayla. Oof. Tail in the mouth. <laughs> Disgusting. There we go. All right. Boom. If you win, you want a tiny ghost. We got minis. So it is a possibility if you win, Sarah. But on the record, if Alexandra wins, she gets a potato and a dollar bill. Hey, hey, hey. Mm -hmm. She'll have a dollar. She'll oh, have a dollar. Don't do it, cat. Give you the flurkin? Uh, no flurkins are leaving this house. Even though they're very naughty, <laughs> they're not leaving. Right. So. Thank you, Kat. A wild flurkin if he is. All right. You want Hagrid and the Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> Hagrid could be arranged for a temporary basis. <laughs> Leftover know? cookies from baking <laughs> with us from last year. Yep. Possibly. Your dollars come in bill form. They do. Yeah. There are coins for dollars, well, but nobody has those here. Can you? You're loony. <laughs> and yes, Buffalo Wild Wings, that is what is sitting on the counter for when we finish. You want to... Oh. There we go. Yeah, we'll do that. So it's 718. How about 722? Sure. We'll do the drawing. Oh, I can't do Papa John's pizza, Sarah. It tastes like cardboard. I don't know. A live stream with Flurkin. We always have the Flurkins around. Pretty They're much. All over. They don't go away. So while we're here, we can always shill a little. We could shill. We could. So if you're interested in Pop Couple merch, yep. there's a link in the description. There is. For teas, hoodies, mugs, and tank tops. Exactly. If you're looking to buy some pops, some, do some pre-ordering, whatever. Spasta collectibles. 10% off using the code Blame, Blame Pop, Pop Couple. Couple. There's also a link in the description down below. Yeah. Got to throw some shillage yep. in there. So there's all the shilling you'll get from us for right now, though. <laughs> Dollar coins at a stripper. Nice. Uh, Brian, we know that you and Brittany are salty. It's okay. We like the salt. Yep. We're salty sometimes, too. Kyle is flying. You need a pop couple banana hammock. I don't think Teespring offered that. I don't think that was an option. I can go back and look, though. <laughs> so. <laughs> Papa John's is horrible pizza. What's really good pizza? Amici's. Amici's is good. Amici's is damn good. I do like Mountain Mike's, at least, though. Yeah, at least for Mountain the pepperoni. Mike's is good, but... Show us all the merch. You want to see the merch? It's just what we wore last week. Yeah. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> My go-to is Pizza Hut. See, Amici's is like 30 minutes from us, but if you want if we want really good pizza. Yeah. We would drive down. So. Cope says, nah, Brian, it'll fit me. We good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. For anybody who wanted to see the merch. A salami sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> There's the merch. So yep. got classic tea, comfort tea, and premium tea. Premium hoodie. Classic hoodie. Classic tank top. Women's fitted tank top, and a mug. Does it show the back? Uh, I can make it show the back. So we'll go to the comfort tee, so that if you like, the you back, can see the back says, lame pop couple. Yes. Please hold. Must have a dog there. Must let out. Hi. So yeah, 
There you go. If anybody's interested. Uh, what? Huh? What? What? Who? Who? When, where, why? Never. Uh, do the shirts come in your size? Uh, I, I mean, I don't necessarily want to ask here in chat what's your size, Riley. But, but you can click. They it goes up to, to 5XL. Yes. So there are varieties. There's no extra small. So if you're an extra small, I, I apologize. You can't get one. So. <laughs> Brian, Riley, yes. They do. <laughs> so. so no. <laughs> Oh, it's 722. LJ's on it. Yes, All right. Is. Good, because we need to go eat our dinner. So thank you, LJ. Facts. All right. So All right. Ooh, there's 52 wow. comments right. now. All right. So we will Sharing switch over. Please hold. Refresh. All right. I wear a medium on my thigh. All right. <laughs> All, All right. right, there we go. So I'll do it one more time. We have 52 comments. So remember, the comment has to say hi from Pop Couple. Yep. It can say anything else with that, but it must say that. Yes. Three. Two. One. Go. Hmm. Oh, K Titus. Oh, I'm sorry, K Titus. We will have to pick we'll another one. Or repick. Sorry. Flirking around my feet. Here we go. Try it again. Three, two, one, go. And the winner is Aurelio. Excellent, Hi from Pop Aurelio. Couple, new subscriber here. Yeah, no, I saw that. I know. It's okay, yeah. Jayla. <laughs> so it just had to say hi from Pop Couple for our purposes of this evening. Yes. And this one does. So Aurelio is our winner. So message us on IG with your info and we will get a mystery item sent out to you. Yes, indeed. So I know Aurelio was in here earlier. Let's see if he's still here. Maybe, maybe not, maybe, maybe not, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, either way, uh, I, th I think he's messaged us before, so we'll we'll find out. Oh, there he is. There yep. we go. You want a mystery item? Hmm, I'll have to think about that, Brian. Right. So, all right. So, anything else? So, tomorrow night here, 6 p.m., same time as tonight, Pacific Standard Time, nine o'clock Eastern, eight o'clock Central. Uh, there will be a six way mystery box mystery box challenge for chrono toys spring break boxes so you're very welcome jayla so be here or be square yes i don't know rules i don't know if there'll be giveaways raffles anything like that but as of right now that's where we're at for tomorrow yes um should any of the six channels want to do something we'll figure it out Indeed. um so enjoy the rest of your evening yeah and we will see you back tomorrow night three nights in a row Yay. yes <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye, everyone. <laughs>